Thank you, thank you. Welcome one and all to another edition of The Early Show with me, your host, Aidan Stone. Aiden. Stay home, stay safe and protect the NHS. My next guest is going to tell us how what breaks you can make you, quite literally in his case. Please welcome Steve Judge. So Steve, Steve Judge. I needed a positive vision. Uh, and this is where we come to with the, the thing that I really want to talk about is getting the mindset right. And this is something I wanted to give to your students or explain to your students is how I did that. So in, this is about opportunities because opportunities are out there all the time. Even though we're in lockdown, coronavirus, things are kicking off, there's still opportunities. You've got to see them. You've got to hear them. You've got to smell them. And you've got to do something about it. You've got to take action. And this is what I was going to do. Next picture is this one here. Right. So here you can see, I want the students uh, to draw a picture of where they are now. Now that might be st sat at home in coronavirus lockdown. It might be at the school. Mm -hmm. I don't know. But what are they doing now? Who's around them? Uh, and, and what are they doing? And it could be even their hobby. I don't know. It could be or, or their education. Mm -hmm. Don't spend too much time on this side because, A, what I want them to do is spend a lot of time on the right-hand side. Yeah. This is their vision. This is what I want them to, to see themselves in the future. This could be next year, five years, ten years' time. It could be even when they retire. But what are they doing? What have they achieved? What's their accolade? Is it in sport? Is it education? Are they a doctor, a surgeon? Are they a pianist? Yeah. Are they a musician? But also, I want to put as much detail in as possible. This is very important. Who's around them? Uh, what, what's the weather like? Is it sunny? Is mm. it colourful? Put some colour into it. Put yeah. as much detail as you can, because this is what their vision is going to be. And I really want them to do this in their tutor groups, and this is almost like their homework. And I think this would be really good for them to do. And I know it's a family show, but thanks for the vision. Thanks for the story. That's amazing stuff. Um, okay, no problem. Thanks, Steve. Thanks. So I asked Dr. Richardson, uh, what should year 11s be doing right now? And this is what he said. <laughs> Dr. Richardson, how the... heck are we going to award GCSEs and A-levels this year? Good question. Uh, and the first thing that we need to, that the year 11s and year 13s need to realise is that um, their job is done. There's nothing that they can do now to, uh, to influence the result. So why don't I just give all my group uh, 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 the top grade? You remember we would, we now would grade GCSEs from nine to one, nine being a star star or something like that down to one that you put your name on the paper well done something like that so um so why don't i give all my lot a nine or failing that why not invent a new grade a 10. that would be that would be nice uh, dr richardson thank you very much <laughs>